When I first saw the hype surrounding the Tianjin Binhai Library online, it sparked my curiosity. Does China have more spectacular libraries like this? I wanted to see for myself. My journey has taken me from the mountains of Inner Mongolia to the Chinese coast and its great cities. Join me as I explore some of the most beautiful and celebrated libraries in China. I'm Leslie Montgomery, and this is Design Asia. My journey started in Beijing. With a serious lack of Mandarin skills, a heavy suitcase full of camera equipment, and my Google Translation app in tow, I made my way to the Zhao Jiehe village, a picturesque village in the mountains, one and a half hours north of Beijing, where the Liyuan Library is located. I arrived in Zhao Jiehe village on a sunny and windy mid-April day when the cherry blossoms were blooming. In the village, I stayed at a simple cottage-style hotel with friendly staff, who fed me and showed me around. After a short 10-minute walk along the stream, I found the Liyuan Library nestled around the mountains. Upon first glance, it looked a little desolate. From the outside, the library reminded me of a contemporary version of one of the wooden houses made by one of the three little pigs. The outer wall of the building consists of thousands of individual twigs. Li Xiaodong, an architect and professor at Tsinghua University, designed the Li Yuan Library, which opened its doors to the public in 2011. He was inspired by his first impression of the village and the textures of the twigs that the local people use in their cooking stoves. The Li Yuan Library is an is a intentional effort to, to make people feel uh, they are kind of uh, embraced with natural materials, with books and with light, very warm light. Well, we have a, a collection of about 7,000 uh, books and uh, all kinds of subjects you can find. Yeah. Walking into the library felt like entering a cave. But shortly after, a welcoming, warm space with ample natural light emerged before me. Bookcases line the walls, and there are blocks of bookshelves throughout the library. They function as storage for the books, and steps for the users to reach a book on a higher shelf. Even though there are no chairs in the library, the multi-layer bookshelves create cozy nooks and spaces for people to curl up with a book. A space is like uh, a container of energy. A good space means that you feel comfortable, you feel energetic or relaxed in that particular space. The library offered the village a new way of life because the, uh, every weekend, uh, roughly about five to six hundred people go to the village to see the library. And of course, it will create tremendous economic uh, opportunities for, for the villagers. Everything about the library, the materials, the color palette, and the construction techniques are all designed to blend in with its natural surroundings. The simple yet elegant design is a nod to ancient Chinese rural houses built with natural materials. The Liyuan Library is a serene space that encourages a slower pace of life. A gentle reminder that humans and nature can coexist in peace, even if it's just for a weekend. <laughs>